ओके हाय फोक्स या वेलकम वेलकम बैक टू खतरी थिंक क्लास एंड द टैक्स फॉर टुडे इज टू शो यू अबाउट हाउ टू अपलोड इक्लिप्स प्रोजेक्ट इन जी टॉप एंड अपलोडिंग मीन्स डूइंग मेनी थिंग्स दैट इज पुशिंग पुलिंग एंड एडिटिंग द प्रोजेक्ट ओके सो दिस ऑल दिस थ्री कॉन्सेप्ट विल बी प्रैक्टिकली ऑब्जर्व हियर all right so before that your first step would be to create a github account and log in to uh, with your respective github account um, and um, create the new repository okay let me uh, show you this is my personal github account so i just create a new repository from here or i can also create from here okay create new okay let me create and it's called toll road okay and this will be the solution for the toll road project uh, of my previous um, uh, uh, video project that i have um, done okay you guys can also check it out and now you have two options that is public and private public is for uh, for anyone okay who wants to just create the repository and who wants everyone to anyone to choose to commit it what is private you have to pay it and it's for private projects okay and that is restricted to some private members and you just create the repository so after creating the repository repository you will generate this link okay so this is the location okay where your all the files and folders of the project that you want to um, store in this uh, location will be uh like uh, this is the location to store that uh, your project and uh, for your information there are also other methods to create the repository that is by uh, using the command line okay uh, but uh, we prefer to use eclipse okay and it's a uh, plugins that is provided for git uh, for git like the options for git push pull and editing functionality we will be using this uh, now okay you created the repository open your eclipse uh, and go to the project where you want to which you want to push okay so this is my eclipse and i'm trying to just push this project today this project to that repository location so for that uh, i just uh, yeah this is my project and i will be pushing all this this is a test um, for, uh, like project for this project uh, okay and this is um, this is the test package uh, this is default package then uh, all the sub java classes are here and also the requirement um, okay are also provided here so i will just push all these files okay for that i already said you have to go here right click it go to team then you have to share the project you can also share many projects at a time go select the git option then you click click, click next and this is the you select the tool toll road project location and then you create the repository yeah it will create the repository now your repository repository is created so immediately are you finish it so you can you can see some you must see some changes right here okay maybe it's working in the background so after that team share project jit yeah we are we just created now we have to commit the project okay for that let's go back again uh, yeah we must have the project created right team yeah okay so now it's done like you can see the differences right so right now it's a repository that we have created because previously it was just a normal project we didn't have such kind of uh, greater than sign and now uh, we have a greater than sign and we this is our 
repository now again you team you commit the project you go to team you commit okay this is your first commit okay and you select all the files and files that uh, you want to commit so uh, I select all these Java files at first uh, I ignore this kind of um, extra files uh, and I will tell you later on yeah. okay so why I ignore this um, other files because these are some kind of files which are very important for the the master user that is um, uh, pushing this project uh, this uh, okay so if you do not want okay this is also that the note that you, you have to be careful about is like this contains important files and inform important information about your project okay so that you do not want other users to access so should not commit this kind of file so be careful do not commit uh, this kind of um, files in, a rep in the repository alright this especially this project and uh, class path and JIT ignore now immediately you commit yeah you committed it then let's go to this step now you go to the go to step 6 that's it that project team repository review now you see the repository review project team so repository review yes this is your JIT repository I have also another repository that is a web forum project repository okay this is my uh, toll road solution repository so so we have to click on the remote okay create re uh, remote repository then origin right go to remote create remote that's the origin now we are configuring the push uh, part of our task okay so okay now you have to change the URL you guys remember that there was the URL uh, URI uh, that was generated when we created the new repository in uh, github yeah this is the the repository the, the URL like now we copy this HTTPS link we can also copy from here okay so after that yeah I have actually I have already yeah just uh, paste here now uh, you have to provide your github uh, username and password uh, like uh, what is the name uh, okay now just configure the push here and now yeah generate the master okay you just did it save and push and again give your username that is uh, okay so now we can generate a master branch okay for this repository and this is the repository link alright so after that you can see here the master branch is created and it says that it's a first commit okay so after that okay now go to your website and uh, just refresh it Okay, you will see that uh, the new repository is yeah toll road is immediately created before this this was not there right so you can see all your files uh, okay that you committed and requirement example java file toll road and this is a test project from, okay 
so you can see that it's also a first commit that I have made now after that we configure we are sure that now we are we configured the push part of our task now we have to configure the pull option like the pull part of our task so for that go again to the repository yes and go to remote here you can see there is only yeah this is a pushed and this is the pull part of okay push and pulling so you just right click and configure the fetch that is the second part of our um, task now configure the fetch and you have to add and what we have to uh, add uh, the remote repository the link is the same and for the source is the master yeah is the master branch is the main source yes we now finish the configuration now save and fetch yes and immediately fetch from this so origin okay that's the master now we said okay so configuring part uh, for the pull option that is the fetch is ok now let's configure the master branch ok for that let's go to the local master ok now configure the branch main branch for remote you have um, you can see it from here that is the origin and for the upstream branch is the master that will be somewhere here yeah reference master okay yes no now we also configure the master branch after that okay so now we are done for um, with the configuration okay now we are done uh, uh, with the configuration of um, pushing okay fetching then the master branch now I want to show you now if you edit the your your file okay if you edit if you make any kind of commit if you want to make a second commit so how do you will make it so you know, th this is my second commit okay uh, uh, this will be shown only after I commit alright so uh, if you go and check here check your example java because you can see that this was my example java file and if you go and see here in the repository uh, in github nothing is shown there right so how can I make changes edit and then this will be shown in the, uh, in the repository so for that I just save it here first thing I commit it yeah now I have to say that this is a second commit that I have made okay and I commit it yes so even if I refresh refresh is the same thing right it's not shown here so what we have to do is you have to go here and you go to the team and you have to say push to the upstream okay now provide your pro respective user and pass okay so now master second commit you can see it immediately that second commit and the date was also March 7 2015 11 a.m. something like this okay now if you go to your to GitHub web page and if you refresh here yeah, you can immediately say that see the second commit that you have made okay so this was the idea about making the commit okay and lastly there is a tip for you that is like whenever you make the commit so if you want to show the difference between the new commits made okay then the original code before then you have this option like for example I made this commit and if I even if I made the another commit another the third commit or maybe third fourth fifth I keep on making the comment uh, I keep on committing it okay so how can I make the difference that this co is the the com is the commit that I am making 
so for that you can go to windows preferences and yeah immediately you can type uh, either type here quick difference okay you can say here or you can directly go to the link okay quick difference yeah you see here and enable quick difference you enable the quick difference and you say you change the color you can change the color to red okay you apply it okay so whenever now if you make the th third commit okay let me make the third commit here and it will be at the end okay I say this is my third commit that I am making okay but respectively it is is not shown here why wait let me check it out okay apply now I have to also show, show difference in over lower now okay yes now this will be shown this is my third commit now you can see the difference by the color right after you save it it will be removed but immediately if to after you type it all right before there were some some red marks right so this is uh, this is uh, is to be done and this is the normal trick to show the difference between the comments that you are making okay so that's it for the for uploading your code in uh, github the eclipse project from eclipse and uh, that's that was it all 